And it wasn't just the area of the mall. Check out this before and after. Leah Parrott shared these photos of Congress Park Drive in Washington Township. Here on the left, you see it flooded. Then once the water recedes, you can see just how high it was by the line of debris on the hill. Our Kelly King is out there live tonight. Kelly, the water rose fast, taking many people by surprise. Katie, that's right. Those rushing waters came very fast this afternoon, but since then they have receded. However, there is still a sign out here warning drivers of the possibility of high water. Residents in this area say it was like nothing they've ever seen before. It seemed like the, the, it came out of nowhere. Our whole backyard is covered as well. Buckets of water dumped on parts of Washington Township this afternoon, closing roads and forcing drivers to find alternate routes. Water covered tires and parking lots became swimming pools. At first, people were driving through, but really cautiously. And now, obviously, it's kind of impossible to get through. The parking lot to the Washington Township Rec Center off 725 also became a pond. John Wright just came to the wreck to play basketball when the heavy rains moved through. Yeah, we were playing basketball and one of the people that works here came in and asked us if one of our cars was out here and we asked if it was a uh, Chevy uh, Malibu and we said no, so came out here and sure enough it was my car underwater and our friend's car's underwater too. His stereo and speakers ruined by the rain. This is definitely out of nowhere and I didn't expect water to be all the way up in the seats of the car. Friday's flood waters submerged cars all over Washington Township. Several vehicles even got stuck. And while most of the rising waters have receded, residents are hoping they won't see this kind of rain again, at least for a while. I've heard that this road has never done this before, so it, we're hoping that this is the first and the last. <laughs> Now, officials say if you do see standing water, don't drive through it. You never know how deep it can really be. For now, we'll continue to monitor conditions out here and keep you updated. Reporting live in Washington Township, Kelly King, 2 News, working for you.